So for today, we're going to be looking at the seasonal challenges for week five, and we're going to be looking at Eververse for this week. So if you guys don't know, I usually make these videos weekly, so that way you guys can know what the challenges are if you guys are not in your computer or in front of your screen right now, and uh, Eververse as well, in case you're wanting to get something and you need a reminder. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe, really does help the channel grow because a large portion of people that come to my channel are not subscribed. So anything would be appreciated. But other than that, let's just get into it. So for the first one is sorrow band, sorrow bound five, complete bound in sorrow five and defeat nightmares on the moon. This one's not hard. It's literally the story of the week. So just complete the story of the week. And this one should be completed. The nightmare ones should be the only one that's going to take you a little bit. But again, if you're doing the, the main, uh, seasonal, uh, activity, then this should be pretty fast. Nightmare Containment 3 successfully complete tiers of Nightmare Containment public event on the Derelict Leviathan throughout the season. I'm at all, like almost 60% on this one. It's just that the for me personally, the seasonal activity is kind of a a slog after a few after you after you run it a few times, it's just kind of like I don't want to run it anymore. So that's why I'm at 60. Umbro focusing, focused weapons and focused armor. This one's not too hard. You just have to focus wep or weapons and armor in the Crown of Sorrow. This does count uh, all of the stuff you've been doing throughout the season. So if you've been doing it a lot, then you'll get it. If not, then, I mean, you still have a few, like what, five weeks left, I think. I don't know how long this season lasts anymore. <laughs> After season of lo the loss, it all fucked me up. Uh, complete sever grief using only a void subclass and void kinetic or stasis weapons. So I haven't done this one for week four as well because I just kind of forgot. This one, I am assuming you have to have all void kinetic and stasis weapons as in you can't have anything else because it won't, it won't actually activate it or complete it. So having completed this one on week four or week seven or week five. So I'm not too sure how to complete this one because I haven't done it yet, but that's what I'm assuming uh, for sunburn defeat guardians bonus progress is guaranteed for opponents defeated with the help of solar effects this one's going to be kind of annoying because ignitions are kind of wonky to actually activate in the game specifically for pvp so this is going to be annoying kind of uh but thankfully you just have to defeat guardians this is uh the bonus progress is just that it's just bonus progress so uh this would have been cool to have at mayhem but whatever uh linking linking the chain of command choir chain of command this is this is, this is the seasonal weapon from the playlists uh this one's not too hard i got it on both gambit and uh, crucible already i haven't gotten it on vanguard but vanguard is terrible in my opinion so that's why i haven't gotten that one and then last but not least leviathan reaper cabal and nightmare bosses defeat cabal bosses and strikes for vanguard playlist defeat nightmares anywhere in the system Okay, so this is like one of those annoying ones where you just have to get Cabal bosses in the Vanguard playlist, which is irritating because sometimes you'll get like everything but Cabal sometimes. <clears throat> so that's pretty much it for the seasonal challenges. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Uh, I took a little bit of break uh, this past weekend so I can play some Minecraft because I needed to mellow down and just kind of like reset because I was playing a lot of Destiny. So let's go on to the actual ever store she is selling argent tor tor this is the shader from the skeleton armor which is pretty cool i'll hopefully have a picture up here but it's really cool that they have this because uh i appreciate when bungie gives us shaders of armor pieces because it really helps us if you if you want to keep that shader there it helps us to like make sets with that shader on intact so i really appreciate that we have a uh, ossified entrance. I'm not looking at that uh, conductor, which is you're literally just a conductor in a symphony. I guess you have the hydrofoil shell, which is yeah. And then for the stuff at the bottom, we have splinter projection. Definitely not looking at that one. We have the what was it called? The class items for the solar armor which is pretty cool definitely pick this up on the class that you want i really like the hunters and the titans the warlocks is kind of an L in my opinion uh junkyard navigator which is it looks like crash or trash which is completely fair uh 
sea foam glide which that looks pretty cool um i'm not gonna get it but yeah, it looks pretty cool we have fire break shell which is the firefighter themed uh shell we have alone to be joined this is a pretty cool ornament for uh this side armor i forgot what it's called uh drang it's pretty cool i definitely like these ornaments for the menagerie weapons and then we have sparrow getaway which is pretty funny um yeah and for the shaders we have lucid which i am i'm not the biggest fan of this shader to be quite honest the only reason i actually want to use it is because the color palette reminds me of the <clears throat> the uh oh my god it's from 40k it's basically a demon prince uh primark for for uh i don't remember his name but it reminds me of him and i want to use the shader because of that we have the royal treatment which is a really good shader a very a really good purple a really good gold if you have the void armor from last season and you want that shader this is the shader so definitely pick this up if you don't have it i love the shader and then we have shattered sinew which i personally think is one of the best red and white shaders we have in the game uh, definitely recommend this one as well and then nectar dynamo which i i it's funny because i always say this like i like it but i would never wear this so Pick up what you don't have. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you guys like the seasons, the challenges this week? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, yeah, I I have so much planned. Uh, so much planned. I might make an update video because what I have coming up is gonna change my channel a bit. Uh, because I'm essentially gonna make another channel. Uh, and yeah, I'll I'll talk I'll talk about it in the in the update video, but let me know what you guys think and I'll see you guys later.